as an opera singer, you have operas where you are like a character in a story. There's a stage director who tells you how, what to do. There is a conductor who tells you how to sing. And your freedom is this in, mid, in between all those um, bosses that you have. And then recital is for me, like this show, an opportunity to express my creativity and to do what I want, how I want, when I want, and to choose my program, to choose how I will present it. And especially to have a communication with the audience. That's something I love. That's something I have from my metal years. And that's something I miss with the opera. And that's the moment I can do that. I can involve them. I can talk to them. And uh, it's very important. Like I love, I love people and I love sharing, as I said. So uh, recital gives me all, all this freedom and uh, it's wonderful. I'm very quickly bored in my life. So this uh, is always a challenge because you will see it tonight, for instance, and in Grafenegg, uh, to go from opera to chanson or jazz. My recitals are not going to be a Schubert Winterreise. I, I'm proposing something different. And maybe you like it, maybe you don't, but this is me because me staying at the piano for an hour and a half, not talking to the audience, not moving, I can't do it. So. That's it. I have to be also honest with myself. And, and so these crossover things are just reflection on my personalities and also a way for me to maybe I try to connect with a wider audience uh, because I believe an audience that is not really into classical music or doesn't really know if they see some songs that they recognize from jazz standards or pop songs, maybe it will make, it will make it easier for them to come. So that's also my target.